Well, good morning, channel. Welcome back. Good morning channel. Welcome back. This is a special happy Labor Day morning vlog this morning. Hope everybody has a wonderful Labor Day today. Ironically a day that most of us are not laboring. Thought I'd get out this morning while the temperature is wonderful. 82 degrees the bike is saying. And just take a take a ride this morning I'm heading north out of Frisco Texas and heading towards Blue Ridge one of my favorite destinations there's so many well hello biker there's so many twisty routes that get you there it's one of my favorite uh, journeys anyway a couple things this morning I'm also testing out these new you see them down there Icon Stormhawk boots come in three colors I just got this pair and uh, for years I've worn my uh, Milwaukee riding boots and they are showing their age so it was time for some new boots I've heard good reviews about these boots and I gotta tell you, putting them on, they have that unique. There's no, there's no Velcro, no no laces. It's a I forget. I'll put it at the top of the screen what it's called. A unique binding system, easy to use. It's, you know, it cinches it up very snugly against your leg, and these things are comfortable. I mean. I could walk around all day in these things. This is not a full review of them. There's plenty of those out there if you want to if you want to see about their build quality and you know other things. Just you know, there's plenty of information out there you guys can find. But I'm I'm just giving you a cursory review of. I put them on. I ordered them off the internet, Revzilla, and. They're true to size. Um, I ordered what I normally wear and it fits just fine. They're waterproof. They've got a membrane inside them that keeps them waterproof. And man, that might this might be the best purchase I've made all year. Just really comfortable. So we're doing a little of that. You'll notice once again I have my camera mounted to my chin using chin mounts. I just have settled on, and even though it's on my helmet adding weight to my helmet, it really is the best view or the view I like the most for my vlogs. So I think I'm going to try to keep it here. That T mount I was using the other day just wasn't working for me. So. I think it's going to stay here. Coming up on US 380. Runs east-west pretty much across the entire northern part of the Dallas-Fort Worth Metroplex. And look at that sun coming up this morning just behind the clouds. Beautiful. Sorry about the wind noise. Let me raise my windshield, see if I can get some of that off. Yeah, that helps a little.
but now I'm looking through the line of the top of the windshield. Eh, it'll be okay. I am ready for some cooler weather, man. Here in North Texas, it's been triple digits for, what, 40 days? I don't know. 40, 35, 40 days, I don't know. But finally got a break the other day, and it's been slowly inching better. Can't wait for fall. It's still a little bit off, but... Ready for some cooler weather for sure. Brought my camera with me this morning too. Might get out and take a couple of shots. That sunrise a minute ago would have been a great shot, but there's... Here in this area, there's so much human stuff, telephone poles, lines, lights, cars, I don't much care for that stuff in my photographs, so I'm just going to enjoy it while I ride, alright everybody stay in your lane, be nice. say a shout out this morning to a few of my frequent viewers Mr. Road Glide good morning it's getting cooler my friend and we have a day with a cup of coffee soon my friend Larry up north go wing moments this is his YouTube channel go check him out he just finished a pretty long ride up there in Canada. Some beautiful, amazing scenery. He's posted on his recent videos. Go check him out. Good morning, Larry. Hope you're doing well, my friend. Cruise man. Good morning to cruise man. Had lunch with him, or sorry, breakfast with him yesterday. No, I guess it was the day before. Holiday is throwing me off a day. He and his buddy Don. I want to say a good good morning and shout out to Don as well. These two guys. Y'all remember back when we had Lotus 1, 2, 3? Before the Excel days. The accountant's coming out in me, but bear with me. There was a term in there was a term in Lotus called WYSIWYG. WYSIWYG. I forget the acronym, but it was pronounced WYSIWYG. And what it stood for was what you see is what you get. And it basically was an improved user interface for either Lotus 1, 2, 3, or it might have been early Excel. I don't remember. But the reason I bring this up is cruise man, his buddy Don, and his other buddy Dale, I have the privilege of joining them for breakfast from time to time, and those guys, the reason I love hanging out with them is they are definitely WYSIWYG. What you see is what you get. Genuine, nice guys. Never any BS. No hidden agendas. Just great motorcycle and other discussion. And some great breakfast. I want to shout out to a lot of my photography YouTubers that never watch my channel, so... <laughs> they're not going to hear this, but I'm going to shout them out anyway. Mr. Thomas Heaton, a photographer in the UK. When I first got involved with YouTube, I started following his channel. So much fun to watch. He's such a professional. Great photography. 
Gavin Hardcastle, another YouTube photographer. Uh, and if you like crude humor <laughs> and a lot of good photography and sort of make you laugh out loud videos, go check out Gavin's channel. He's a great guy. Never met him, but love his videos. Adam Gibbs, also in Canada. I uh, think got his start in nature or uh, garden photography for garden magazines. The man has an eye for nature photography like no other and can fly a drone skillfully forwards or backwards through the thickest brush. Just some beautiful drone footage on his channel. And again, a nice guy. And Mr. Mass Peter Iverson, who I have met. You guys will remember if you've been watching my channel, uh, went to the Fairwa Islands uh, for a photo workshop that he hosted. Uh, amazing, fearless guy, young guy, <laughs> part of why he's fearless. Um, but some of the most amazing photography on the planet. You need to check out his YouTube channel, Mass Peter Irison. And last here in the States, Mr. Nick Page. I gotta tell you, Nick Page has a very unique style of editing his videos, and they are phenomenal. He just got back from, I believe, Iceland, and some of his photos and drone footage and drone photos from Iceland, unbelievable. Just fantastic. Good morning, Nick Page. I've also got my Vantrue F1 dash cam running this morning. Such a comfort knowing that's capturing all of my activities. In case I ever need it, hope I never need it. But I'm glad I have it. And look at these giant flags coming up here. America, folks, America. God bless the USA. And Texas, by the way. It's a Texas thing. You would probably understand. Wow. Big flags. We got rain on the horizon. But I think it's further off than I'm going. I'll be hanging left up here over the lake soon and heading north. Well, you can see on my Waze app down here that I'm coming up on Lake Levon here on 380 in North Texas, North Dallas area. I'll be, there's a small county road you can see it there on the map, County Road 559. I'll be hanging a left on across the lake. Man, this lake has been up and down. I've seen it so low that the bridge I'm going to go across up here, you, you can see dirt under it. And then, you know, here lately it's been filled back up. It can get as high as right under that bridge. It's a good fishing lake. Lots of trees. Good for fishing. A lot of people come out here and fish. We're going to hang a left here on 559. Glad to get off 380. It's okay early in the morning, but it's a busy, 
busy road normally. Oh, look at this scenery. Just beautiful. And the lake is pretty full. You can see on the shoreline, and maybe maybe two or three feet down, but other than that, up right at the brush line. twisties in here. I gotta say I am loving this bike. Ah, makes me makes me wish I had purchased one earlier. I don't think I would enjoy the nothing against them but the ones earlier than 2018 the Gold Wings they were a bit on the heavy side for me but in 2018 they changed the body style up slimmed them down to this version and man I like the way they look I like the way they handle center of gravity is so low it makes it nimble I am loving the DCT you know I didn't know how I was gonna feel about that but I do not miss the clutch lever I don't it's just the way it is and in every every way possible other than pulling in a clutch this operates with some of the best bikes I've ever ridden. It's pretty expensive. It's probably the last bike I'll ever own. But I am so happy that I made this choice. Welcome to rural North Dallas, folks. the sticks now folks welcome to farm road 2756 nobody coming get up and go and that's in tour mode didn't even have it in sport all right coming up on OA 78 Texas 78. Gonna hang a left here and that'll head us right into Blue Ridge. Never trust a turn signal.
good to see clouds. We've had so many days without clouds, nothing but hot sun. Temperature right here in this low line area is 80 degrees according to the bike. Feels great. Absolutely great. These morning motorcycle rides are certainly salve for the soul. Happy you guys are joining me. Although there's no way on film I can portray the feeling. Many of you who ride know exactly what I'm talking about. Maybe I can find some place open here on Labor Day that might serve a good breakfast or at least a cup of coffee. Hello, biker. safe my friend the old water tower. Nick's Cafe. I think I've stopped here before. Looks like this is it. Maybe we can get a cup of coffee here. Back with you soon, folks. All right, out here at Blue Ridge. Beautiful little town. I've got the breakfast of champions going on right here. Check this out. Got my black coffee. And I don't know how old they are, but it's about all they had in there. I guess Nick's supply truck. Uh, you know, hasn't come yet. <laughs> Love that old water tower out there. Oh, somebody has a damn good looking bike. Oh wait. Man, if I ain't the poster child for unhealthy. Good gracious. Million calories, zero nutritional value, zero. Coffee's warm. All right, Nick. Thanks for the breakfast, such as it was. Coffee was tolerable. Gotta love this reverse gear. So the 
question is, which way do I want to go back? Do I want to go back the same route over the lake? Or Farm Road 545, which I know for a fact is twisty and wonderful. I think we'll do it that way. All right, let's get started. All right, Blue Ridge, thank you. On our way back now. guys think I'm gonna end the video here enjoy this ride back to the house if you haven't already please subscribe to the channel if you like this kind of content also pepper it in with some photography content look for some great photos coming this fall as we head to Colorado and the occasional Bronco content where I'm adding something Anyway, I appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you for joining me this morning. And we will talk to you again soon. Until then, my friends. Ride safe. And God bless.